cute little reindeer made with chocolate coins. Let's see what's cooking. It's time for yo yo Banks 12. Hello everyone. First thing we're going to do is make some antlers. You can use regular chocolate or in this case I'm using candy melts. Melt it, put it in a piping bag. I'm using a writing tip, but you could just cut the corner off that bag. And you're just going to draw out some antler shapes. Just make sure that you extend the antler shape down a bit because you need a piece to attach to the coin. And I'm using that coin as a reference for size. I'm drawing these on a piece of waxed paper and then I let, let them harden. Now for each of these little reindeer, you will need two of those chocolate coins. One of them you'll leave plain, the other one you're going to peel off one section of the foil. Usually these have a top and bottom foil, so peel off the top foil or the bottom foil to expose the chocolate, and then you'll have one that's plain. Take the covered one and put a little bit of chocolate on top of it. Then you'll take your antlers that have hardened and you've peeled them off the wax paper and you're going to attach them to the coin. Now that's why you need to extend the antler down a little bit so that it has something to attach to. Then add a little bit more chocolate over top because you're going to stick that other coin on top of it. So I filled in some gaps, put a little bit extra chocolate on top and then just took that coin and put it right on top like that. Press down a little bit. You want to make sure it's even and it matches up with the bottom coin. Now for the little mouth, I'm using some red frosting. This is actually commercially prepared frosting. It comes in the tube and your little writing tip attaches directly onto it. I made a little smiling face shape and then two little dabs of melted chocolate that I'm going to use to attach the eyes. For the nose, I'm using a little miniature M&M, but you can use any red candy. And then finally, these commercially available candy eyes but you could just use a dab of white frosting with a little dab of black frosting and that is pretty much done but you may want to decorate this a little bit more to make it look more Christmassy what I did was use a gr green gumdrop and I cut the gumdrop into little pieces using a pair of kitchen scissors tried to make little leaf shapes added a little dab of melted chocolate and then I used a toothpick just to pick up those little pieces of gumdrop and stick them on and then finally, to make it look like holly leaves, I added another little dab of chocolate and then added two little red candies. Now, if you can find candy holly uh, somewhere, you may be able to use those instead of making your own, which will make this a little bit faster. But anyway, uh, you'll see how the holly really adds to it. It really makes it look Christmassy. And there they are. These are quick and easy. This is something you can most certainly make with kids. They can help you with assembly. And you can even add them to a, a cookie platter. I think they'd be, look really cute to decorate a regular cookie platter. It would make it super Christmassy. And these are a lot of fun to eat as well. Thanks for watching. Now I have two other what I'm going to call edible craft recipes involving reindeer on my channel. I have these adorable marshmallow reindeer as well as these more elaborate reindeer using Twix and pretzels. So if you haven't seen these videos, go ahead and check them out. Bye bye.